The Tampa Bay Lightning managed to keep the dream of a three-peat alive after winning back-to-back -back elimination games against the Toronto Maple Leafs in the first round. The 4-3 series win will see the Tampa Bay Lightning take on the Florida Panthers in the second round of the playoffs, painting the reigning Stanley Cup champions up against the present trophy winners. While the Panthers enjoyed a prolific regular season, they struggled in the first round against the Capitals in what many expected would be a cakewalk of a matchup. Florida went down early in the series before rallying and winning 4-2, but it was a far closer matchup than many had anticipated. The Panthers' offense wasn't as sharp as it looked through the regular season. While they managed to get the job done, Florida was often slow out the gate and found themselves playing from behind far too often. That might have been something they could have overcome against Washington, but it would be far more difficult to claw back against the Tampa Bay Lightning. The Lightning are looking to join exclusive company by being one of the only teams to three-peat, and getting past the Panthers will be their next test. Without further ado, here are my predictions for the Tampa Bay Lightning and the Florida Panthers. But before we begin, make sure you guys subscribe, hit the like button, and turn notifications so you know when I publish next. With all that out the way, let's get into today's episode. One area the Tampa Bay Lightning will have the advantage in the series is in goal. Andre Vasilevsky is one of the hockey's best goaltenders and he proved that throughout the first round. When the team needed him the most, Vasilevsky was impenetrable, surrendering a total of 4 goals in the final 2 elimination games. In that span, the 27-year-old recorded 60 saves on 64 shots, good for a sterling .938 save percentage. He's at his best in games following a loss, and he's been huge for the Lightning in the clutch all year. If he's at his usual self, the Panthers' high-octane offense may struggle to inflict its usual damage. The Lightning have some of the more experienced playoff performers in the league on their roster, and they'll lean heavily upon them in the series against the Panthers. Nikita Kucherov could be the team's X-Factor in the series and will likely look to be assertive offensively in order to give Tampa an edge. Kucherov had 8 points in the first round series against the Toronto Maple Leafs and we're expecting him to play an even bigger role against the Panthers. The 28-year-old pulls all the strings to the Lightning, alongside Steven Stamkos and Braden Point, and the trio will look to inflict damage every time they step out on the ice. Double-digit points may sound like a lot, but for a player of Kucherov's caliber, it's something he can achieve even if the series doesn't extend 7 games. The Florida Panthers will also look to keep their momentum going as they've won 3 straight games to beat the Washington Capitals in 6. Although many expected the Florida Panthers to beat Washington in 5 or fewer games, the Capitals exposed some flaws in the Panthers' game, which should be a concern moving forward. Even though, yes, they won the President's Trophy, the Panthers' defense and goaltending were shaky against a Capitals team that does not have a very deep offense past its top six, especially considering Washington was without Tom Wilson. Florida's defense has been a concern all season as it ranks just 17th in the league in 5-on-5, expected goals against per 60 minutes. And also their goaltender, Sergei Bobrovsky, was not bad in the first round, but he was also nothing special as he generated a .906 save percentage in six games. A bigger concern is Bobrovsky's performance against the Lightning in the regular season. When facing Tampa Bay this season, Bobrovsky possessed a troubling .85 save percentage and 4.03 goals allowed average. While the goaltending battle being a crucial element in any playoff series, Bobrovsky falls short of Vasilevsky in every key metric and statistical category. As a result, I'm going to go with the Tampa Bay Lightning to win this in 6 games. Thank you guys for tuning in, and have a wonderful day.